And welcome back to Friday Briefing. Thank you so much for staying with us. Well, it's time now for our guest anchor. And like I mentioned, I have members of the Kenya Archery here in studio with me. Interesting stuff, guys. How are you? How are you, how are you doing? <laughs> All right, fine. So let's start the introduction. Ali, can just look at the camera and introduce yourself. Uh, hi, guys. My name is Ali Khan. Um, I've been shooting with Kenya Archery Association for the past one year, and I believe we can make it to the top of archery in the world. Oh, lovely. Uh -huh. uh, hi, I'm Jojo. And is that your real name? No, it's the name yeah. from God. Okay, fine. <laughs> All right, we'll, we'll go with that one then. Uh -huh. I've been shooting with uh, the Kenya Archery Association for about three years now. Okay. How yeah. far can you shoot? About 70 meters. No, seven. exactly. 70 meters. 70? 70. Yeah. 70 meters. That's, <laughs> wow, that's quite a distance. Yeah, it is. And you do it through a small, tiny little hole. Yeah, we got a little pin on our, on our bow. It's called a sight. All right. Yeah, so you look through that and aim for the center. So if you're really short-sighted, can you do it? Yeah, as long as you can see the colors on the target. Then, as long yeah. as you can see the colors. Yeah. All right, and to the lady. It's really um, interesting to have a lady. My name is Zaya. I'm 16. And 16? Yes, 16. Okay. And I have been shooting for about a year and a half. Okay. How do yeah. you like it? It's, it's, it's a really interesting sport. It's fun and it's like, it really appeals to me. Uh-huh. Is it fun really? Because, I mean, you just like stand and then, I mean, what, what fun no, is there? No, there's a lot to it. Yeah. There's like... You have to use a lot of things. You have to be. You have to be focused. Uh -huh. You have to be calm. Uh -huh. um, so you have to use a lot of your like mental capabilities. Right. And then you also have to like have like a certain level of strength. Because okay. like bows are not easy to pull back. They're, <laughs> oh, like, they're not easy. Yeah, like the one Actually, I, I pulled. Tried and, yeah. yeah, this, this the is one, yours. Yes, that's mine. Okay. It's thirty-two pounds. Wow. Yeah. So that's quite heavy. Mm -hmm. All right. And to the young one here. So it's not a spot for just you know adults. But you do it. What's your name? T talk to us. This is the camera here. Introduce yourself. Hmm? This is the camera. This is the camera here. Introduce yourself. What's your name? What's your name? Hi, my name is Michael. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. And how, how how many years are you? Eight. Just eight. So that means you're in class two. Class two, and he actually does this. All right. How about you teach me how you go about it, Michael? All right, so, so what is that called? This. Mm -hmm. No, what, what, what are you doing? What are you doing there? OK, so you just place the arrow on to the, OK. Help them, guys. Cool. <laughs> what you just did is, yeah. you just pick up back. Mm -hmm. uh, so what he did is, you call knocking your arrow okay. on the string. Yeah. So the, you can see the colors are different uh -huh. here. So this. Uh, odd color yeah. is normally supposed to face you. So if you're right-handed, okay. so you hold the bow with your left hand, uh -huh. and then this color faces you. Okay. So if you're right-handed, uh, sorry, left-handed, then this is the okay. side that faces you. It's so technical. Yeah. So how long does it take? Come, Michael, come and have a seat. Come and have a seat. So how long does it take until you're able to even shoot even 10 meters? Uh, well, uh, every beginner, like if you're new to the sport, right. you start at 10 meters. Oh, okay. Have a seat. Yeah, so mm -hmm. you get two hours to shoot. Uh -huh. Yeah, the target is just over here, and then mm -hmm. you aim okay. for the center, mm -hmm. yeah. mm -hmm. which is, All right. it takes a while, but it's not that hard. Okay. Give me a go. Hmm? All right. Okay. <laughs> there. Our sister designed for adults. Sorry, Michael. Okay, there you go. So, Ali Khan, t talk to us about uh, this sport. So, is it as popular as you'd say other sports are in Kenya? Do you have ma very many members in your association, or is it something that is coming up and new? Uh, yeah, it is a growing association, mm -hmm. and it's uh, slowly getting more popular, and I believe that we see more new people coming to the sport every Sunday where we uh, shoot from four to six. Okay. And yeah, we get a lot of newbies, guys that think that they have potential to go far, and we see archers coming up very fast in sport. And, and what's the fun about it? Because I mean, okay, so let's take for example, I mean, uh, you know, there's football, there's you know, rugby, quite a lot of action, but this seems to be a very different kind of sport because you have to, like Zoya said, concentrate. So what fun do you, you know, what is the fun there? Um, sometimes. We shoot apples. Yeah. Oh, really? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> like okay. Robin Hood things. Yeah, eh? yeah, yeah. Pumpkin. Pumpkin. You've, sh you've shot a pumpkin? 
And do you have any accidents, Zoya, um, you know, when you're shooting? Are there any um, accidents? Yeah, well, we have, like, an arm guard, which is basically this. Okay. And if you don't wear one, there's times where when you, like, shoot the arrow, like, it comes and it, like, hits. Okay. Yeah, um, yeah your yeah. forearm. Okay. Over here, yeah, and you can get like bruises and stuff. But that, that's about it. And is there a way that you can shoot and then it comes back and some injures somebody? Is that mm, has that no, that's ever not happened? Possible, no. So let's talk about the lady Yanwa who went to represent us in the Olympics. First of all, how was that for you as you know archers here in Kenya? Um, well, for me, it encouraged me yeah. to like someday probably get to that level. Like yeah. it motivated me. And yeah, hopefully one day I will be going to the Olympics with her. All right. So what does it take to go to the Olympics like Anwar did? How far do you have to shoot? Uh, you have to shoot uh, seven meters. So you are actually, you can be able to go for the Olympics if you wanted to? Eight. No, I need because to get, you shoot I, 70. I, I shoot 70 meters, but I have to get to a specific score, which is at the moment, well, the Olympics was 630 out of 720. Okay. Yeah, for men. Uh, for women, that was... 600. Hello. Yeah. Uh, Cookie was able to get to 600. Okay. Yeah. And she beat everyone in Africa, so yes. she was able to go. All right. Yeah. Let me come to Michael. Michael, you're a bit quiet. So, what do you love about this sport? Hmm? What do you love about this sport? I like going for competitions. Okay. So, have you also oh, you've gone for competitions? Uh huh. How are they? Do Fine. you compete against other children or adults? Not adults, mm -hmm. other children. All right, and you really love it. Okay, he's, he's so measured in his words. All right, fine. So we want now to get to where you know we see if you can read the news. So let me select Zoya. You're the lady in the team, and you know, much respect for that. So let's see if you can actually just uh, get a what do you call it? Another career choice. <laughs> so what do you do? You're a student? Yes, I'm a student at the Aga Khan Academy. Okay. Yeah. All right, fine. So can you see the camera there? Mm-hmm. All right. So we, you introduce yourself, and then you take it away. All right? Okay. Just um, have a 